Ashley Eskeva, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today, I'm going to show you how to check for a system update on your Android device. Now, that's important because system updates allow for bug fixes, and you'll get the greatest and latest features and enhancements for your Android phone. So let's check out if we have a system update available on our Samsung Galaxy S2. So we'll start off by heading into our settings menu. And from there, we want to scroll all the way down to About Phone. Once we tap on that, you'll see a whole bunch of information about your device. Well, what you're looking for is system updates. Once we're in system updates, you'll see on our device, we have four different options. Update firmware, profile, PRL, and Android. Now on your device, it might be a little bit different and there might be a variation on those words. There could be something like update device, check for system update, Anything like that, that's what we're looking for. So we're gonna tap on update Android. If there is an update available, it will go ahead and let you know that. If there's not, like we have here, it'll say your system is currently up to date. If you're wondering how often you should check for system updates, I like to check about every six months. Android tends to let you know if you have a system update available. You'll see a prompt saying that there is an update available for your phone and it will ask you to start downloading it. You probably want to have an internet connection as opposed to a data connection. You also want to make sure that you have a lot of juice left on your battery because this can sometimes take a few minutes. So it will let you know that it's finished downloading your update and it will ask you if you'd like to install it. Now at this point, once you start installing, you want to make sure that you're either plugged into a wall outlet or that you have a lot of battery life left. And on top of that, don't touch your phone while it's updating. You definitely want to leave it alone for the 5 to 20 minutes it might take for your phone to update, depending on how large the system update is. And that's how to update your Android device to the most recent system update. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content, and we'll see you next time.